Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I want to、uh, demo to use the AI voice clone and、uh, texture to speech to show you AMD CPU market share news. Let me know what do you think. If people like it, I will do a follow up on the tutorial about it. Let's、uh, get started. According to Mercury Research, Viaton's hardware. AMD gained 5.8 percent unit share in desktops, 3.8 percent in laptops, and 5.8 percent in servers. In terms of revenue share, Team Red gained 4.1 percent in desktops, 5.1 percent in laptops, and 1.7 percent in servers. The report does not mention competitors by name, but the global PC industry only has one other. Major CPU supplier, Intel, which has a major stake in all the market segments. While Intel and AMD make 86 processors for PCs, Qualcomm offers ARM-based processors for Windows notebooks, but its market share is minuscule by comparison. So, while the report doesn't say anything about the market share of Intel or Qualcomm, it is fair to assume that most of AMD's gains came at Intel's expense. Based on this data, AMD believes its desktop market share was at 19.2 percent in Q3 23, a 5.30 percentage increase from the 13.9 percent share during the same period last year. In the laptop market, the company's estimated market share was 19.5 percent, up from 15.7 percent during Q2 2022. In the server market. AMD garnered a 23% share, up from 17.5% during the year-ago quarter. The report attributes AMD's strong showing to its fourth-gen PC and Ryzen 7000 series processors, both of which were released over the past year. It is it is interesting that the Ryzen 7000 lineup has been such a hit for AMD. As it requires a total platform upgrade to socket M5 and DDR5 memory. In comparison, Intel's 13th and 14th gen Raptor Lake processors still use the same LGA 1700 socket as its 12th gen Alder Lake CPUs, and support both DDR4 and DDR4-5. Meaning, people do not have to invest in new motherboard and RAM. To jump to the latest platform, the global PC market is starting to show signs of recovery after multiple quarters of negative growth. Over the past few months, sales showed a marked upsurge thanks to increased consumer activity for the back-to-school season. With the holiday season now in full swing, sales should remain strong for PC Owens, which is good news for chipmakers like Intel and AMD.